Okay guys, so before I begin the video, I just want to say one thing. If you hear these weird background explosion sounds, don't worry. North Korea is not nuking us. Yes, that was my shameful attempt at a joke. Uh, it is 4th of July, there are fireworks going on in the background, so I do apologize. You do hear, th you do hear those every once in a while, so I do apologize. Uh, don't worry about it, don't worry, I'm not going to get blown up, it's just fireworks. Well, hopefully I don't get blown up. What's going on guys, welcome back to some more Gary's Mod Dark RP. Now today, we're on the same server as episode 3. This is pretty good. What's going on here? Excuse me. Excuse me. Jeez. People are so rude. But uh, we're on the same server as episode 3. And today, we're going to do something interesting. Now, the first episode I ever did, I will put a link to that in the description below, by the way. We What is this? That's weird. Okay, but we decided to set up a printer operation based thing in the cinema, which is two doors down from the police station. But... In today's episode, we're going to the next level, and we're setting up one in the police station. Yes, you heard me right. We are setting up a printer operation in the police station. This is going to be fun. I really don't think it's going to work, because there's, like, no good places to do this. But, uh, you never know, guys. We may get lucky, and it may work. We can just do it right in a jail cell. They'll never even suspect a thing. Okay, let's go in here. This looks like a pretty good and secure spot, as you can tell. And, uh, so we're going to go in F4. Go to entities. What type of printers do we want to buy today? We can only have a total of, I think, eight. Yeah, we could have a total of eight printers. So, let's start out with the green printer. Oh, I gotta hit the buy button. Crap. Let's start out with the green printer. We have to make this seem like nothing suspicious is going on here, because obviously, people are gonna see this printer, and they're gonna know something suspicious is going on. So let's just hide this thing. Oh, crap. Okay. Well, now... They can't even see it, because they think it's, you know, they think it's a dog cage. There we go. So they think it's a dog cage, you know, they're walking in, they're like, I hear a printer. Oh, no, that's just a dog cage. Okay, sorry, we could leave now. So they're never going to suspect a thing right here. They're, they're not even going to know this is my printer. So I might as well upgrade this crap all the way. It earns a total of $2,250 a minute. Not bad. Uh, could be better. But let's kind of make this blend in a little bit more. Okay, guys, so it blends in pretty well. They can't really tell that there's any printers back here. And, uh, I think we're pretty good, guys. I don't think anybody's gonna be able to tell. Like, for example, let, let's do a little, like, little test right here. So, like, let's just say we're a normal guard, you know, walking through the prison. Oh, what's in there? I hear something. Oh, those are just dog cages. I shouldn't worry about those. Now, there's a problem, actually. I just thought of it. Uh, I can't exactly use these. So, I guess we're gonna... You know what, guys? Forget, forget hiding it. They're unusable when they're hidden. We gotta make this a top quality operation. Where is a shelf? No. Oh my gosh. Whoa! Oh my gosh! Bro, I've been practicing. Holy crap, I was just kinda getting mad and just throwing it to flip it over, but I did not know I had that many skills. Oh my gosh, dude. Yeah, say hello to your newest Olympic star, Robocast. Like, I don't think anybody's ever done that before. Pretty sure I just broke a world record or something. Okay, well, we have enough printers. There's too many as it is. So I think we can get rid of these ones. Uh, I don't know if they hurt me when I shoot them. Oh, this is the slowest shooting that I've ever seen. There we go. Nice and secure. Okay, guys, so I believe we're at the point now where we have ourselves our own official, you know, organization slash room or whatever you want to call it. So, you know, you walk into police station, be like, yo, yo, I want to see Robo. You walk back here, see the sign, Robo's Crib, come breed with me. And uh, you come in here, shut the door, and you have yourself this lovely little hangout with these lovely money printers. This one's actually overheating. But uh, I think this turned out pretty good. I really thought we'd get some more action. I've been here for like 20 minutes and haven't seen anyone. But uh, you never know. I'm going to wait around for a little bit longer. Maybe somebody will come in here. I want some sort of confrontation or action or something. It'd be interesting. I want to see what happens with other police officers. But uh, I guess we'll have to see, and if nothing happens, we'll, you know, change jobs, become a thief, and maybe, like, raid some people or something. I don't know. We'll have to figure it out as it goes. I just want some sort of confrontation. It'd be interesting to see what they do. Oh, hello there. How are you doing? Uh, yeah, I'll let you out. What? This guy didn't even notice. How did he not notice? He was right in here. Dude, the guy didn't even notice. He, he spawned, like, right here. Actually, I think he spawned in my thing. I don't know, dude, but he spawned and he didn't even notice. Like, what the heck? I don't know how that even happened. Whatever. I feel like I'm gonna get raided now. He probably saw it. But, uh, wow. I was just, you know, walking outside and I saw this guy. And he didn't even notice 
my stuff. <laughs> what the heck, dude? I'm so done. Yeah, um, you know, I'm just I'm just locking up shop and leaving. I don't know what this guy's saying because I'm talking at the same time. But uh, yeah, I feel like there's probably no, there's probably no reason to go in there and stuff. You know, I think we could just walk around and arrest people. No, no, no. There's there's no reason to go in there. There's no reason to go in there. Uh, jail cells. I think there's another door. Prove it to me. Show, wait, what? Yeah, see, look, watch. See, all there is is another door and some jail cells. See, like, you can see all there is is some, you know, jail cells. Also has reason to believe you let a meth addict out of prison. I did not do such a thing. <laughs> and he also told me that you did it. Uh, I, I never let any meth head out of prison. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh god, is that a gun? True. Is it? No, it's not true. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Put the gun off. You first, okay. Yeah, you better be scared. We can be civil about this. Okay. Now, answer me. Did you let the meth addict out? No, he escaped. He, he slipped right past me, dude. He told me that you let him out. No, like, I was walking out the door, and he goes, Yo, Robo, so I turn around, and he just sprints out. I couldn't catch him. He's too fast. Uh, hello. These are legal. Oh, hey, Patricia, what are you doing, fam? I mean, uh, what's your name again? Moniqua? Hey, Moniqua. Hey, right, can you guys please step out? I would like some privacy. That's why I don't have any windows on my house. Work your magic, Patricia, or Uniqua, or whatever your name is. This isn't working. This isn't working. Have you ever done this job before? I don't tolerate lawbreakers. Hey, hey, stop, stop, you thief. You, you, you have a money printer. You, oh, crap, I'm trapped by the bed. God dang it. Come here. Hey, that's illegal. You cannot own money printers. That is illegal. Help, this guy owns a money printer. That's illegal. That's illegal. That's illegal. <laughs> hey, you better run. Moniqua. Oh, I need that money. It's a lot of money. Hey, hey, stop, you thief! Come here. I'm so bad at this job. Oh my, you're too fast for me. Too fast for me. There we go. Yeah, that that person had this money printer. It's it's in their name. Destroyed the evidence. I feel like all my money printers are gonna be gone. Uh, do you want me to unarrest you, ma'am? What's this do? Oh! <laughs> this is the Harlem Shake gun. Okay. Guys, I believe it's time for a new job. I think we uh, have been caught. People are on to us. They know what we're doing. So now it's time to change jobs. We need to be something a little bit, you know, not nothing like that, basically. We, we gotta change jobs, guys. It's, it's not gonna work if we if we do this crap. So what are we gonna be? We're gonna be a... Hmm, let's be a hitman. I love killing people in this game. It's fun.